Hey Al, this is Daryl at HudsonsCustomMachining.com. I've got this little piece reproduced for you here that goes in your tractor. Uh, this is the switch that um, turns your lights on. There's the pointer that goes on here and there's a, I guess a cable or some kind of a something that attaches here and it rotates this uh, shaft around. There's the off position. You know how this thing works. I'm just showing this for some of the folks that may be interested in seeing this video. And I'll show you how it all fits together in just a little bit. But before I put this piece in, I wanted to show you that uh, your old one that you sent me uh, was pretty badly brittle and falling apart. In fact, uh, well, <laughs> there it goes there. Uh, but anyway, Al, I made you a new piece. There's the ball detents uh, to hold it in each place where it's supposed to go when it rotates around. Um, I'm going to try to piece this uh, video together, but I wanted to show you this piece here before I actually installed it, okay? So I'll kill the camera for now. We'll put this together, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so here it is. Everything's all put back together. We've got all that in there. The pointer's back up here in the off position. And as you see, these contacts are not making contact with the uh, with this piece here. This uh, has power on it all the time. So as we as we rotate this around to the next position, if I can do this with one hand, okay. It stops in that little ball detent up there that I showed you a while ago. So we're in this position now. You see that we're making contact on these two terminals here. And as we rotate it on around to this position, <clears throat> you'll see now that all of these are making contact here. And uh, I wish I could rotate this with one hand, but it's just, it's just a little too hard to do and hold the camera. <laughs> all at the same time so there we go back to that position and then back to this position all right and there's a lot going on here all this has to be uh in time uh with this rotation there's a this shaft that goes through here all the way through uh there's a hole in that shaft and uh this hole in this piece has to line up for that screw to go through there so that this won't slip on the shaft um and you notice the cam shape of this uh piece up here so it can uh, uh so it won't hit uh down in the bottom down here this is cut away uh what else oh we've got a uh there's a a slot up here for this uh pointer to go in to keep this pointer in the in timed in the right place on the shaft so, so there was kind of a lot going on and then this has got to be in the right place on here of course to make the right contact when you rotate it for that position so there's kind of a lot going on there but everything's working good now there's the old broken one that came out from in there and uh so i'm going to get this box back up and get it out to the person that belongs to all right Thank you for watching the video. Y'all subscribe if you will. If you enjoyed this kind of thing, take care. We'll catch you later.